Hi, welcome to Kathy's Eclectic Garden. I'm Kathy. I garden in Zone 5B, 6A in Northwest Ohio. I'm going to be doing a series on plants that are thriving in my garden. We'll be right back. Today we are going to talk about one of my favorite plants in my garden. This is false indigo or Baptisia australis. This is the native false indigo, false blue false indigo or sometimes called blue wild indigo. This plant is two years old, is looking glorious. It is huge. This one is about almost three feet tall and about three feet wide. And they can get up to six feet wide, but three to four feet is about the tops on their height. It spreads by underground rhizomes, unlike any type of watering. Um, it can be dry, average, moist or wet, as long as it is well draining. This one is planted in my bumblebee retreat garden which is one of my native gardens and the insects do love it. It prefers a little more acidic soil so I have to put some soil acidifier on this one a couple of times a season to keep the soil the right pH. To propagate this plant you can collect the seeds in late summer. They get little, almost like bean pods. Um, I believe this is in the legume family. It's herbaceous perennial. And you can collect the seeds and plant these wherever you want. But sometimes they don't come up for maybe years later. They can become leggy and need staking. Mine have not done that yet. I've got three of these in my garden, and all three are different color. I hope you enjoyed seeing what's thriving in my garden right now. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.